so excited. <laughs> oh my god. professor switched class to zoom today at 10 instead of 9 30 and we're watching a movie so <laughs> but happy monday i have two classes today i have my english class and then i have a typography class from three to seven and in between those classes i'm getting coffee with a friend so very exciting and my tote bags are supposed to arrive today so whenever those get here i am sprinting to the mail room and also since class is now online I'm gonna hope to get some painting today I've been waking up like every morning wanting to paint and it's such a nice feeling so I have an idea of what I want to start <laughs> I ended up going to the art store. Um, they're having a really big sale right now on canvas. These two were 50% off, so I did it. I've been feeling really limited on palettes right now or panels. It's just so flat and I mix the buoyancy, I don't know if that's the right word, but the bounce that happens when you paint on a canvas, a stretched canvas. And I've been feeling really limited in the size. I'm still gonna use the panels I have. I have much I want to explore but I decided to get two canvas. I got 18 by 24, which is pretty standard size, but it's bigger than I typically use stretch canvas for. Um, and this one, I'm gonna put a landscape on, and this big boy, I'm gonna do a figure on. Um, I really like doing longer canvas figures. Oh, that's cool that you can see my reflection. I like doing longer canvas for figures because I feel like I can map the body out more and I want to do it in kind of an, exp an expressionistic style um, kind of similar to the other figure I've done in the past but I want to bring it into a whole series but it was really fun to go to the art store and I only spent 50 bucks in total because I also got two bristly brushes I love the texture of these brushes they're really fun for doing abstract art and they're cheap and I want to I got a uh, painting paper a while back in another previous vlog and I want to do more of my swoopy stuff that I've done prints of in the past so these are what these brushes will be for and for these um, and then <laughs> I always go in the pen section and I got some pens these are like $1.50 each and these are my favorite pens ever I love them I've been using a green one because I used to have a full pack of them and they've wandered away over the years and so I got some more colors. I have class in like an hour and a half so I think I'm gonna do a little bit of painting. I don't think I'm gonna start anything on these yet because I want to sit down and devote some solid time to them so I'm going to I think work on a landscape piece for a little bit.
Oh no! I'm taking a pause because I got paint on my shirt. Paint on my shirt. <laughs> <laughs> I have something very exciting in this box. If you have been Following along my studio vlogs recently, you will know that I ordered tote bags last week and a little bit of chaos ensued with that process. But after a week of waiting, they are finally here and I'm gonna open them and I'm so excited. Okay, I'm not showing the box just because obviously it has my address on it. I'm like nervous. <laughs> this is, uh... The size is kind of perfect. Like, it's the perfect like hand holding height. They're actually like pretty cute size. Like I've never seen this like square type size in a tote bag before. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> oh my god. My, my heart is beating so fast. This is just a huge milestone for me in my business. I've been wanting to do tote bags forever and now they're finally a thing in my shop and I already have so much like interest in them and I'm really proud of myself. I'm really happy with the tote bags themselves. The quality is honestly amazing and I'm not even saying that just because it's mine. It is thick and durable and it is really well stitched and it has like kind of like I don't know what to call this when it like kind of pops out so it's kind of rectangular and has that in the bottom as well like these are truly really high quality tote bags and I'm just so so happy and by the time this video comes out because this video is not coming out for a while they will be up so you should buy one please support my business and get yourself an amazing amazing tote bag like truly I might have to keep one of these for myself. I'm probably going to list it because I'm hoping we'll sell out, but if we don't, or if we do, I might keep one and like do another order. I don't know. I, I'm really happy. Over the next few days, I took product photos and I started working on graphics and promotional material for the items. I didn't really vlog much of the process of me taking these photos and promoting everything and all of that and also doing the release. I always get very caught up in the moment and making sure everything is running smoothly and I'm doing all I can and I don't remember to turn on the camera so I apologize for that but also I think that's the way things are and that's okay. Managing a business and also doing video content can be kind of di difficult sometimes and I am being very intentional and about what I record and all of that and I wish I could share more of the process with you and I think as I continue to grow it'll be easier for me to do so but as I'm still learning and acclimating it's a little harder but these tote bags are absolutely amazing. I'm so, so proud. So please, if you want to, if you are, want an amazing, amazing bag, please go check them out on my website and get yourself one. They're absolutely amazing.
And now I finally got to work on my new canvas. Oh, it was such an amazing feeling. I'm really of the belief, the same thing, same philosophy I have with books, that you have to have the medium, the surface, the container there for a little bit and just let the idea flow to you or let it call to you. I love having canvas in my room of different sizes and different proportions and just let them sit there until I'm called to use them. I think it is a really freeing thing as an artist to have the ability to do that. It's not something I'm really able to do here in my dorm. Of course, there's also financial constraints, but to have these canvas and to be able to paint on a larger size than I have in months was so freeing and so amazing and I really felt like I connected back with my spiritual side of painting in this piece. A lot of abstract stuff and finding a figure within the abstractions was really really fun and this piece has evolved so much more since I filmed these clips. I painted randomly one night, which I don't typically paint at night, but I have a nice enough lamp that I can now and it was so beautiful. So so show you some progress on the painting and maybe we'll do some more work later. But for now, enjoy the piece of painting. Don't forget to get yourself an amazing tote bag. They truly are so incredible. LiveToyArt.etsy.com. Go get yourself some beautiful art on a tote bag. It would mean the world and support my dream. Thank you for being here. I hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day. And thank you for sharing this space with me and allowing me to share my art with you all. Have an amazing rest of your day. And please like and subscribe. Okay, bye. <laughs>